welcome back to my channel. Today I have a back to school lunch ideas. So I filmed Monday through Friday all of my kids lunches and also their snacks. Also my daughter at school, they like them to eat breakfast at school just because they're trying to teach them how to like sit at the table and eat together. She is in the special needs classroom and they eat breakfast in the class. So I originally was feeding her breakfast at home and then just like packing like a second breakfast slash lunch for when the other kids eat in the classroom she's not watching them um but then i just decided after the second day to just let her eat breakfast in the classroom so in the morning i will give her like a little bit of orange juice and maybe like half a banana or something to hold her over until 9 a.m because that is when they eat breakfast at school and i usually um leave the house around seven in the morning to drop them off at school so in the morning i'll give her a really small snack with some like juice and then I will pack her her breakfast for school. So you can see like the first two days, it's just like more of like a snack, like a granola bar and maybe like chocolate milk and stuff like that. And then once we get into like day three is when I started actually um, packing her actual lunches. So like eggs and waffles and stuff like that. So this is gonna be a Monday through Friday school lunch ideas for kids. If you guys are new to my channel, my kids ages are five and six. So my daughter is in special needs classroom and she's in kindergarten. And then my son is six years old and he's in first grade. So these are the lunches that I packed for both of them. Now I'm not claiming that all these lunches are super healthy because I know a lot of these things that I packed is processed and junk food, but this is just works for us. This is what I pack for my kids lunches. So hopefully I can give you guys a few ideas of your own if you have little ones and you are looking for some back to school lunch ideas or even if they just go to like steak here or a nanny's house if you need to pack them some lunches these are some really great choices so now let's just jump in to my back to school lunch ideas all right guys so i decided to show you guys when i prepare the kids lunches so i'm filming myself preparing all their lunches now i did forget to film friday so you're not going to see me preparing their lunch on friday but you are going to see monday through thursday me preparing all of their lunches let me know in the comments if you guys prefer it when i show you guys when i'm making their lunches or if you just like it when i get straight to the point and show you what i packed for their school lunch and then the next time i film one of these videos i'll make sure to film it however you guys prefer I I also like to pack your lunches the night before unless I'm making like something warm. So if it's like a hot dog or like mac and cheese, something like that, I will quickly make that in the morning just because I want it to be a little more fresh and warm. So I make that in the morning. But if it's just like a sandwich or like lunch meat or something, I do pack that the night before. All right, you guys, so this is the kids' lunch and snacks for Monday. So I'm going to start over here. Like I mentioned before, I will be feeding Madison breakfast at home, like around 7 in the morning, and then around 9 o'clock in her class, they will be having breakfast, and I don't want her to watch everyone else eat breakfast, so I'm just packing her, I guess, a second breakfast. So this is what I packed for her second breakfast, which is this Horizon chocolate milk. I also packed this blueberry um, organic just like a cereal bar and then this stony feel whole milk um pear and spinach mango yogurt so that'll be i guess like her second breakfast and then for lunch for madison i packed her this once upon a farm this is a smoothie and strawberry banana and she loves these so i thought the smoothie would be good for her and then i packed her a peanut butter and jelly and i just used a little sandwich cutter and they're like little puzzle pieces and then she also has some strawberries and then she will have some water in her thermos. And then for, I guess I'll just continue with Madison, for her afternoon snack, I just packed her some Apple Jacks and then this Annie's gluten-free chocolate chip granola bar. And again, she will just drink some water. I'm gonna fill this up with water and then I am going to pack another like little mini water bottle so that if she drinks all of this, they can just refill it. So moving on to Ryan, this is his lunch. I packed him almost the same thing. So he also has a peanut butter and jelly except it's a dinosaur shape. He also got some strawberries up here. He has some cucumber slices and then stony fields organic little um it's like a smoothie yogurt drink so that's what i packed him and then he will also have just a mini water bottle i also put these cute little picks in there he loves those picks so i thought i would add that in there just to make it a little cuter i didn't put it in madison's because she'll put it in her mouth so it's dangerous for her and then for ryan for his afternoon snack he's going to have a blueberry granola bar with some cheerios and then another little um mini water bottle and then I'll also add 
a cute little lunchbox note in to their lunchbox with a napkin. So this is Ryan and Madison's Tuesday lunch and snack. So I'm going to start over here at Ryan's lunch. So for his lunch on Tuesday, I have one hot dog. He has some carrots, a piece of bread. He doesn't really like wrapping his hot dogs in the bread, but he likes to eat a piece of bread on the side. So I just have a piece of bread right here. And then he has one cut up apple with some peanut butter. He likes to dip his um, apples in peanut butter. And then he has a little mini water bottle. And then for his afternoon snack, he has some yogurt raisins and then some crackers with another bottle of water. So that's Ryan's lunch and snack for Tuesday. Moving over to Madison for her lunch. She has this rice mac and cheese pasta with broccoli. And then I have some cut up grapes and a little strawberry granola bar and that'll be her lunch. And then she'll also have some water. And then for her, I guess, second breakfast, I just have this little pouch. It is by Happy Baby, the apple, blueberry, and oats. And then I have some peanut butter and chocolate um, dry cereal. And then another chocolate milk, because she didn't drink her chocolate milk yesterday, so I'm just gonna pack her another chocolate milk today. And then for her afternoon snack, she just has some Cheetos and a gluten-free um, chocolate chip granola bar. And then she has some water, and then she will also have her thermos full of water as well. Wednesday school lunch and snack. So for Ryan over here, I have a peanut butter bagel. I usually buy the mini bagels, but I ran out. So he just has a peanut butter bagel, some broccoli, and then some grapes. I also put some um, fruit snacks in this little Lego. And then he is going to have this little honest um, like fruit punch drink. And then for snack, he has some chips and a granola bar. And then he'll also have some water with his snack. For Madison for her second breakfast, I made some scrambled eggs and then I just cut up some fruit so that'll be her second breakfast. And then for lunch, she just has some leftovers from dinner with some apple slices and this little pouch. And then she's also going to get a juice. And then for her snack, she didn't eat her Cheetos yesterday so I just packed her some Cheetos again. Teacher only gives them one snack instead of two so I'm only packing her one snack today and it's just those Cheetos. So that is everything. So this is the kids Thursday lunch and snack. So I'll start with Ryan. So for his lunch, he is going to have some lunch meat, oranges, green beans, and yes, they are raw. My kids like their green beans raw. And then I put in a string cheese and some crackers. And then he'll also have this Stony Fields yogurt drink. And then he will have some water to go with his lunch. And that'll be his lunch. 
And then for snack time, I just have these little Chips Ahoy cookies with some popcorn and then another miniature water. And that is Ryan's lunch and snack. For Madison, for her second breakfast, she's gonna have some waffles. And then I put a little bit of syrup in here and then some grapes, hold on Maddie. And then some orange juice and that'll be her second breakfast. And then for her lunch, she pretty much has exactly what Ryan has. So some crackers, cheese, yogurt, um, green beans, oranges, and a lunch meat. And then for her snack, I did put two snacks in today just because sometimes she doesn't like popcorn. Sometimes she does, so just in case she doesn't want the popcorn, I did put in a little blueberry cereal bar just in case she doesn't want the popcorn. And then this is full of water and then she drinks all that water. She does have a miniature one that they can just refill her thermos with. So that is what they are eating for. Right, so this is Friday's lunch and snack. So for Ryan, for his lunch, he's gonna have some French toast sticks. I'm gonna wrap it up in this aluminum. Hopefully it'll keep it a little bit warm. Then he has a Stonyfield blueberry yogurt with some strawberries. And then I just have the syrup wrapped in here just in case it spills, it'll be in this bag. And then a bottle of water. And then for his snack, he has some um, chocolate raisins, some peanut butter cookies, and then another water bottle. And then for Madison, for her second breakfast, she's gonna have some chocolate milk, some of this organic kids, it's like a smoothie drink with some scrambled eggs. And then for her lunch, she's going to have a little mini pizza with some oranges. And then she will also have this little yogurt pouch. Um, I don't like using those applesauce pouches that they sell just because it's not clear. You can't see in it and I've bought them in the past before and they've had fungus in it. So I just buy her these. I know they're for babies, but she likes them. And then for her snack, she's gonna have some chips and some All right, guys, so that is going to end my back to school lunch ideas. I hope I gave you guys some ideas for your little ones. If you enjoyed today's video, please remember to give it a thumbs up. Also, if you have not already, consider subscribing. I would really love to have you be a part of my YouTube family. It would seriously mean the world to me. Also, turn on your notification bell so you don't miss out on any of the videos that I do upload. As always, thank you so much for watching today's video, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.